This was a full stained glass restoration. And what it involves is removing the stained glass windows, fully documenting them, disassembling them, and rebuilding them with all new lead cane, uh, and then reinstalling them uh, with the or original reinforcing system, uh, which allows them to stand the test of time. Plus the exterior glazing on it is vented uh, to allow airflow and prevent uh, condensation and solar gain, which will preserve the stained glass windows for many generations to come. This isn't a window, this is a piece of art. Oh, it is, it's fine art, yeah. definitely. And this, I said, when you're in yeah. church the next time, just look at the detail. Because when you come and, here, and right these there, windows are spectacular. I mean, yeah. they're, 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 they're not the style that you see every day from this period. I mean, they're, they're absolutely gorgeous. You know, you get over the years, you get the soot and sure. the moisture, and then it, it just gets yeah. dull. Yeah. And so when you guys did it and put it in, it right. just pops. Wow. Yeah. yeah. And everybody that came to Mass this morning yeah, for sure. the celebration, as they would leave, they go, oh, look at that. Yeah. And it was good the good Lord gave us a sunny day. Yeah. So it's nice. It's just, it's crisp, it's clean. The, you feel uh, everything just took a level up. So it was a, it was a great job. Long journey, but it was well worth it. Don Lewis just speaks super highly of you guys. Oh, that's kind. Yeah, I mean, he's a, he's a great advertisement for you because he uh, he pulls no punches. He said, these guys are pros. They know what they're doing. Uh, he said the work was phenomenal. And that window, to me, is the biggest transformation. Because, you know, it was dirty. And, you know, it's, it's gorgeous. It's good. Yeah. yeah, it's good. No, we're real happy with it. <laughs> the windows are... Uh, very much beloved by the parish, so I think that they were afraid of losing them, having them restored, and now the parish only feels like they're going to be around for a lot longer. So, um, so anybody that comes to the church comments about the windows and just how beautiful they are and how uh, lucky we are. So people really feel like uh, that's just the thing in the church that they treasure the most. And a lot of people grew up um, in this church and they, they sat by their favorite window or they looked at their favorite window every Sunday. And like we had one elderly gentleman who uh, paid for the, for the uh, restoration of the crucifixion window. <clears throat> and he always sits on pew 25. He said, I grew up, he grew up two doors down the street. And he said, I, all during my life, and he's about 90 now, all during my life, I grew up praying in front of that window. And he said, that's the one I want to restore. And so he paid for the restoration. And he was here this morning. It was the last time he'll be in church because he's dying. So, so he was here this morning to see the window. And so it was very touching. I had to kind of carry him in almost. Um, so, kind of his last gift to the parish, so he was very happy today. It's actual, it's art. It is real art. Uh, and their crews are well trained. Uh, they just, they're on, on the job, on the spot. And when they say they're going to be there, they're there. Um, we think we have probably the best in the state of Illinois. We just had a successful journey. It's just, it's amazing. Uh, the, the parishioners, can only thing they know is so bright and shiny, and it is. They were filthy. Uh, now with protected glass and that, I think we're pretty well set for a long, long time. Uh, I really appreciate it. Uh, the teams were wonderful. They were professional on time uh, and did exactly what we needed to keep the church clean so we could have mass on Saturdays and Sundays. And if I ever hear anybody wants stained glass and done right, I guess I, I'll, be, I'll either call you and tell you to contact them because they always say, yeah, we'll call. That'll work. I'll have you call them. How's that? That'll work.